Hi there, Alan Smith. Hi there to everybody from both of us. And welcome to this big match today. Our match today is Valencia against Zenit St. Petersburg. His game today, the way he's been playing recently, he's the one to watch. Top score in the league so far, six goals. Valencia will go with this team today. Well, they're going to go with 4-3-3 here, with uh, plenty of width for that attacking three. Yeah, you could almost describe it as the Dutch system down the years, and... The three-pronged attack, it can be really potent, but it can be awkward as well for those wide lads. And Zenit will line up this way for this game. Danny plays with Hulk on the flanks. We'll see how the striking option works with just one up front. Well, it was a long time before I got the chance to watch any football here at the Mestaya. Alan, and I must say, I'd heard a lot about it when I first came, and it lived right up to the billing. Yeah, it's, it's a wonderful place. Remember playing here for Leicester? It was actually a trial for me, because Valencia were interested in me. Scored the only goal of the game, but they still didn't sign me. <laughs> a wonderful place to play football. The match official is Zacharias Krizvici. Away, it's Valencia who kicked off. Oh, in goes the cross. And here's the shot. A oh, well saved. Great work by the goalkeeper. Great hands. Maguli. Lovely one touch football. And now the shot. Well, he's had a go. Well, if you don't buy a ticket, as they say. And uh, fair play to him for having a crack. Witzel. Well, that is half time, and the score is nil nil here. Well, he's been in the game, hasn't he? That's the best we can say for him. Um, but not everything he's tried has come off. The opposition defence have marshalled him expertly so far. No chances, really, for the lad. Whistle from the referee, and we're off and running again for the second half. And in with the goal! The goal from the great oak. And it's something of a dying art amongst players these days. The ability to use the neck muscles like that. Great header. And here's the goal again. Valencia are ahead. And the cross is in. He's got his shot off now. That's not like him. He's a good one-touch finisher. He couldn't finish that one. Well, sometimes you just have to take a chance. It didn't come to him that easily, but uh, couldn't quite pull it off. Get there to reach the cross. Ref's gone back to deal with that earlier incident, yellow card. He's one of my favourite refs, he doesn't miss much, this lad.
he's given a penalty. It's a yellow card, Alan. I think that's fair enough from the ref. It was it was a clear foul, and it's a clear penalty. That was an easy decision for the ref. Well, he's dived in. It's a reckless one. at 2-0. Oh! He's just reset the goalkeeper. Well, that's been the story for this goalkeeper today. A clean sheet, and I don't think that's going to change before the end of this match. Oh, he's through. Valencia have got a corner now. Well, you can see what they were trying to do. Just a bit too much height on it. It's gone straight to the goalkeeper. And there we are. The final whistle has gone here. The referee's called a halt at 2-0. Brilliant performance from this fella. Well, so often we think of his creative abilities, but a couple of goals here have won the match for his team. That's the match, guys. A very uneventful first half and a match that looked like it wasn't going to bring a goal. It all changed in the second half though, with Valencia employing a more attacking strategy that allowed the game to open up. A well-deserved win for Valencia as well, 2-0 over Zenit. No injuries to report on from this match. That's all for today guys, I've been the Chin Doctor. Join me next time in the operating room for more FIFA 16 Champions League simulation.